What's going on guys? It's Shay and we're back here again with another video. Today we're going to be returning to Roblox. We're going to be checking out School Bus Simulator 2 owned by Infinity Bus Development. Sorry, Infinity Development, not Bus Development. What am I thinking? Um, I think I did a video on this. I know I recorded one. I don't know if it was uploaded or not. Um, I know I did their last game. I don't think I did a video on this one. Um, but if you guys didn't know, I do have a company within this game. And it is verified. Uh, so if you're not in it, you should go ahead and join it. It's got 1,099 members, which is crazy. That's like real people, I'm pretty sure. Um, it doesn't show all of them, I guess. But I think that number's real. I'm not 100% sure. But people have been doing routes for me. We stacked up 30 grand, uh, which is very nice. You got a little chat in here. This is something really cool that I've never seen really any games would do. Uh, and, you know, for a school bus simulator in general to do is just pretty cool. Um, you know, I can edit things like this. Um, but I think it does cost like in-game cash to make the uh, group. But uh, if you guys want to join that, go ahead. It's, um, I think it's called The Arsonists. Yes. Uh, and it's also in their Discord server if you can't find the right one. Um, but yeah, so we got servers here. Um, I think it just shows like a list of servers. Okay. Um, I don't think I have a map for our company. I, th I know you can make one. They have like an actual, like where you can create routes and stuff in a map. I'm pretty sure. Um, here's events coming soon. Um, let's go ahead and press play. Uh, we want to be a driver. Um, now there are a few issues with this game. I don't know if they fixed them yet, uh, but they got a few buses here. Um, let's go to the dealership. Um, so here are some of the buses that they have. Uh, they got Visions, HDX, CEs. Um, this one says C2 coming soon. Um, and then a whole bunch of other ones coming soon as well. Um, I don't think I have much cash, so we're going to be using whatever we got. Um, these smaller buses are new. Um, so we'll actually, should we drive one? Why not? Um, bus number, let's do 1147. Customize bus. Select part, wheels. Oh, this is cool. I have no money for any of this though. <clears throat> Exterior paint. Oh, that's not right. Yeah, see, like I said, there's a few bugs. White paint. Strobe light. License plate. And then interior-wise, you can change the color of the seats. Which is very cool. But like I said, no money for all that. Uh, how do I go back? Drive bus, there we go. Okay. Um, how did it let me spawn this in without having any... I didn't pay for any of it. Oh, it's definitely glitched. Okay. Let's redo that. Don't... Yeah, see, there's there's bugs in this game. Um, so, beware. So, we're just gonna drive. That should fix it. Okay, here we go. Um... Now, I don't know how to turn this music off. I clicked real world. Oh, there it goes. Okay, good. Very good. Um, so we got lights. Oh, and I like how it displays the district name on the side of the bus. Very cool. Or company name, I guess you could say. Um, but yeah, I don't think you can actually walk in the buses. Oh, you can. Oh. Um, I don't know why. Okay. We need to back up. So it uses an automatic transmission. And it's got some weird noises in this game. I don't even know. You're going to hear them throughout the route. Um, so look, company routes. Okay. So I did make one, but it wasn't. It was like a default one, I'm pretty sure. Um, but let's go ahead and do it, actually. Because every time you drive a route, uh, it does stack up money for the company, which is very cool. Now, do you hear that brake sound? That's one of the sounds I'm talking about. I don't know what that is. And it's very annoying, so I do apologize. 
Um, but I would, f I figured I would give this game some recognition because it definitely deserves it. This is one of the older games on Roblox. Uh, not this one, but their other one. Um, not older games. I meant older bus simulators in general. I think it was... Um, I forget when it came out. I could be wrong, but I, I if I do recall correctly, uh, it is an older one. Um, so props to them for sticking to what they love. We're going to make a little... You have to hold it down, which I'm not a fan of. You have to hold the button down um and it is very dark I don't even think the signals work on this bus they don't okay nope not what I meant to do not what I meant to do turn that off uh, I don't know why it's not turning off okay Come to a complete stop and then F. So they do have a passenger system, which is pretty cool. Oh my goodness, that brake noise is definitely not okay. Not okay at all. You can't drive first person. Not much of an interior, but. Uh, auto warning lights. Oh, that's why. Let me turn that off. That was why. You know what? That's actually a pretty cool feature, though. We'll actually keep that on. You also have steering sensitivity. They've got their own fuel system. Uh, pretty cool stuff. Yeah, no, the only downside to this game is that weird noise. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> No passengers? There we go. Okay, we have to make a hard right here. So it's definitely more of an arcade type of bus simulator. Um, you know, your favorite... Uh, oops. Okay. Um... If you're like really into buses, this probably isn't the game you want to play, but you know, if you're looking to just kind of, okay, there's something definitely wrong. Okay. Uh, but if you're like looking to just play something and kind of stack up some money, uh, cause don't get me wrong. This game has some pretty cool features that some of the other games don't have. Uh, so it's definitely got some pros, uh, but it has its cons as well, such as the unrealism of the buses which is kind of what i mentioned in the last review of their game um the buses were more of an arcade type of bus you know it's not very realistic um but this npc system is a little buggy because i have to open oh what i gotta go backwards okay don't mind us we're just gonna Hello. So this is apparently a Collins. I don't know much about... I think it's a Chevy. I don't know much about Chevy school buses. Oh. What the heck? Okay, yeah. Maybe it's just the route that I created because I just picked them all up and dropped them all off at somebody's house. <laughs> I didn't even drop them off at a school. Okay, let's try another one. Um, let's do that one. So apparently it's an AM route. Also, these lights are just, let me, I will turn that off. Cause it, it just keeps bugging every time. So we'll just do it manually. I think that's what they want you to do anyways. Cause it helps with the. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? I just, I was just there. Why didn't they make me go there first? Okay. Oh.
It's almost as if you have to apply the brakes to get that noise to stop. I think they've got it all wrong. I think they messed something up with the, uh, it's definitely the brakes because watch. I hold the brake down and it goes backwards and it just does something. It turns off. Yeah, no, that's not fun at all. Having that noise go in and out of your ear. If there's one thing you have to fix in this game, it's that. Okay, now this game here is, like I said, it's relatively new. It's almost got a million visits. Um, but I think their old one still gets quite a bit of players. It's got 4.7 million visits. Not bad. And I think, you yeah, know, so it was created in 2018, which is relatively old in the kind of school bus Roblox community type deal. At least I think. Um, I know NBC was just getting started at that time, I'm pretty sure. If I remember correctly, I don't actually know. This man does not know what he's talking about. Some of you guys wanted me to play Rigs of Rods. Uh, just not a fan. I don't, I don't like the controls. I absolutely despise them. Um, if I could bind the key binds to like my WASD instead of my arrows and I do it there is a way you can do that but it just completely resets after I log out of the game and log back in so what's I mean really what's the point honestly um now I do have a steering wheel but in order to get that hooked up you have to have like a controller or something it's all types of messed up which is why I prefer bus simulator 21 uh, matter of fact, I'm going to make a video on that shortly after this one. So, yeah. Um, we definitely, okay, so yeah, we pick up one passenger at a time apparently. Yeah, their spawning system's a little messed up over there, too. They're just going right inside of each other. Pause. Is this a school? This looks like a school. It definitely is, and I took the wrong... Oops. Oh, we're drifting like crazy. Okay. Okay, and this guy's just casually... Don't worry. There we go. Now, how much money do I have now? Hopefully that goes up. Oh, yeah. 560. Nice. Okay. So, that was... Um, let me actually... Let's return to the menu real quick so we can get that noise off. Our, I prefer the music over that noise any day. So, um, that was School Bus Simulator 2 owned by Infinity Development. Uh, let me know what you guys think down below. Like I said, the game's been out a while. If you haven't checked it out, go check it out. Uh, be sure to join my company as well. Um, very surprised that we have over a thousand. That's pretty crazy. Um, but yeah, um, if you guys do wish to play the game yourself, it will be linked in the description down below. Um, for you guys who don't know, uh, game links are always the second link. Uh, in the description it'll say game link it's not the first link it's the second one every time so um i had a few questions about that um but yeah if you guys like the video please leave a like and subscribe and i will catch you guys next time peace